You know, after this, I'm going to go ahead and reboot the uh, phone. Because it makes more sense that way. Anyway, uh, so, I hope you guys are feeling well. And, uh, yeah, my name is Brian Barnett Gantz, and welcome back, folks, going on to Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. It really doesn't matter what name you put in there. You could put in Jack, Jackal, uh, Marie, something like that. I'm not going to play Pokemon, the female version. I'm sorry. It's not going to happen. No offense to females everywhere, but really. Especially, like, it does the same thing, only that your, your avatar is a girl. whoop do you do And no, you're not stronger because you're a female in the game. No, it, it, it doesn't make you any stronger. Hate to break it to you, but that's just the way it goes. Where am I going? All right, let's go ahead and finish off getting this. Yeah, I suppose I could go ahead and finish off doing it in the Bone Dungeon if I want to now at this point, because uh, all I need is uh, about, like, I want to say about two, maybe, because it goes up only up to 99. doesn't go up to 100, though. Well, that's fine. That includes all the uh, items that we get in this game. You know, in this game, there's no actual, you know, f I don't know if I mentioned it, but uh, if I have, completely ignore this. But there's no way to literally revive your characters with a item, because there is no item. There's no such thing in this item, this game. The only one I know of that even has to absolutely do that to you. Uh, but, um, you know, I just, I like it. It's pretty good. Yeah, you know, sometimes I get three, sometimes we get two of those earthworms. And I don't mean earthworm gem. I never played the earthworm gem uh, game or nothing like that that I can remember. I didn't even remember, I watched the damn game show. I've heard of earthworm gem eventually later on when they had like, uh, when they showed it every now and again. But other than that, I didn't even know it existed, so beyond that. So what can I say? I mean, I'm not all that familiar with the earthworm gem series, you know. Which actually, believe it or not, is a series is in, in purgatory right now. Which means that they're not doing anything with it. So it's like, they're not even they're not making anything new, nothing like that. I mean, like you know, I don't know unless you consider like you know Smash Brawls or something like that. You know, that's about it. Oh, missed. That's not that's not a good thing. That more happens when I have three of them. Yep, now this is the time where it comes three, like skeletons. So I'm going to do that. It's very rare to see it with two basilics, but not as rare to see that. And very rare to see that it's by itself. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, use uh, that. You, you crazy? Quit missing. You know, I hate that when you miss. Anyway. So let's go ahead and use this. Nice. Really? No, the computer? Really. So, pretty much, yeah. Uh, 16 seeds. Okay. Before long, we'll be able to do even more spells, and we won't have to deal with so much. We can we can stick to the earthquake if we want to. I don't think cure gets even stronger, but you know whatever. It's crazy that as well that the cure spell it only works on a few bosses, and that's it in the entire game. And a few enemies. Earthquake, mm, you know. You know, something else. Anyway. Oh, 
I don't know if it's recording. You know, that's why I, sometimes if you see that, I pop, it pops up like that, or when I'm trying to do that and it won't pause, stop, for whatever dumb reason. We got a long ways to go. Well, not as long as we should probably do need to go. Um, at some point, I'll just go ahead and just buy the seeds, and that's when we can finally buy seeds. I didn't even notice it when I first did this, because when I did this many moons ago, when I was when I first noticed that I had to have seeds, I didn't even notice I could buy them in, um, you know, the next town over. So. And that's, that's about the first point, and then the last point is going to be over there at, um, I believe it's Windia or whatever. You know. Not that it matters about spoilers about this game, because we've already seen it all. I'm just redoing it so that I can get through the 100% of this thing. That's it. That's the only reason why I'm doing it. So otherwise, I wouldn't even care. Also, I'm trying to... to Try not to do it in as many videos as I had. Not because I'm trying to do it in a competition or anything like that. But I feel like at the same time, because I wasn't that happy with the way it ended up being. So, you know. Yeah, sometimes it's easy enough just to take her and make her use her claw. Yeah, the claw is pretty good against the Basilic anyway. Actually, I say it would be more powerful against Basilics anyway. So. As far as weapons go, explosives are better on these guys, but uh, and they're like this. Um, yeah, I'm just going to use Earthquake on you. I know it won't miss. However, it won't do anything to enemies that are not immune or, or immune to uh, that. So I'm going to go ahead and save here. Yeah, we're at 19. We're almost close to our goal of getting to at least 27. That's not bad. So with three, because we're getting three at a time. That's all we're getting. We're able to do from this because that's what it'll, it'll give you. So 21, 20, 21, 22. That'll be in the next round. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Uh, that'd be more than enough, but it's all right. 28 would be more than enough. But, you know, whatever. Anyway, let me get a little sip here. Yeah, so we need at least probably... Three more rounds, at least, before it's over with, and then we can go and tackle on that. Well, then, when we get done with false base, and we'll only have to do at least a couple of times, and that'll be able, you know, get us taken care of as far as uh, the next area after false basin, which would be good, you know. And that's, I'd say, I'd estimate the seeds that we need is going to be at least around 27, and at least for every area, 23 to 27 max. So I'm just going to go to 27. So. Wow, I've been only recording for that long. And that's because the last episode we got a hell of a lot accomplished for this, this a seed run. So. Yeah, I'm going to do this every weekend instead of Pokemon. And then we'll get rid of... And then we'll take care of Pokemon and... And, uh... Um, so forth because see Pokemon to me is just something that I can do as long as it doesn't crash so, that is just something else and I gotta re I've got to put this on charge anyway so you know take care why do I keep going in here I, always, I, I keep making the mistake of coming in here I mean to go over to here and it's just a force of habit so uh. You know, and what's crazy is that if I actually change the su the thumbnail of it, which is crazy, that it will not load it as a link to um, 
go and check it out. And like if I post it on Facebook, you know, it's fine. But if I post it in Messenger to friends or whatever, it means absolutely nothing. So, yeah, let's go ahead and go back in here. I mean, I got now 52. Now we can lay off on the cure potions for now. I'm going to want to get more po uh, heal potions before too long, but I'll do that uh, before we go into the next area. And I'll do the same thing with getting a bunch of... Um, it might be boring after a little bit, but I'm just going to get a whole bunch of... Um, what they call it, refreshers, which only work in battle, by the way, which is crazy. So, uh, Okay, since you're by yourself, you, know, you can take an axe. And then, uh, and also the worms are a little bit more different in most games. Like this game here, they're kind of like, I would say, uh, more in the range of, you know, I didn't mean to that, but anyway, you know, I don't know how to say it. They're not, they're not hard, but they're not exactly easy, uh, but they're like, how do I put this? I, I don't know what the word I'm... I'm trying to think of it, but it's like, okay, if you've seen them in other Final Fantasy games, they're going to be much more uh, scarier than in here. Because they don't, I mean, they don't exactly use Earthquake, but they can pretty much do a lot of damage. And that's pretty crazy. I mean, that's if you believe in fear and all that, I guess. I'm going to say, so. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm just going to use Earthquake now. Yeah, good enough. Apparently, you're not as affected as I thought you would be if you had three people with you. I mean, two other people with you. So just take a cure to the face and shut up. And I'm going to use um, Earthquake here. Just knock these guys out of the park. And they're done. The GP at this point doesn't matter either, just so you know. I mean, it does matter in the sense that, it, that all the good we can get. So, I'm not, you know, as worried about it, but I'm glad I'm getting it. So, yeah, we're getting there. So, we need to get, uh, let's see, 23, 24, 25. Uh, that'll be in the next round. And the next round after that will be 26, 27, 28. So, we just need two more rounds, and then we're, we'll be done here. We'll have to do a two, two rounds again, but at least it'll be worth it. I don't, I think the Lava Dome is going to probably actually, no, I take that back, I think it's going to be the Lava Dome is going to be a lot more seeds, maybe, at the most point, so, because I think it's got more enemies in it anyway, uh, I didn't say the Ice Pyramid, Ice Pyramid has got more of enemies than False Basin in well, it's basically has less than either, either uh, the uh, Winter Cave. Winter Cave has a little bit of enemies, more than, you know, whatever. I'm just kind of talking about it to myself here, just for the kind of personal record there. Um, and anybody who's willing to listen to that non nonsense, I guess. Anyway, so let's go on here, and then we'll move on. And, uh, yeah, see, now this time I did remember to go over here. So, you know, cause I kept making a mistake of going into Cali's house. I mean, not that there's anything wrong with visiting it, but that's not where we can rest up at. Nope. We have to go over this way, and we're going to save again. Maybe presumptions of me, but I'm going to do it anyway. Because, last at all, I intend to, uh, you know. Why did I get that? There was no need for that. Anyway, let's just go on. I guess, you know, just force a habit. Let's see. At least we don't have to worry about getting any uh, treasures in here and whatnot. That's good. The only treasure, we, well, except for the seeds that actually matter. That's about it. Because this is the. Why are you slowing down? Why are you doing that? Once again, you're by yourself, so I'm going to take you down with my axe. I'm an axeaholic, I guess. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, okay, you can go down with that. 
as well. There we go. We leveled up to level 11 and we got uh, 440 HP. Not bad at all. But we're still a little bit away from getting to where Phoebe or Phoebe is. And like as always, the thing about it is that uh, even if we could get on a level 15, we're not going to have the same exact you know HP until we get higher than that. So that's the way this game runs. Unfortunately, I never really noticed that, but it's all right. No big deal. It's not like the, it's going to be the end of the world because I said that, you know, or because the game's going to change because they suddenly said something that's absolutely changed. You know, but anyway, no, come on, really? Was that necessary to miss that? Anyway, so uh, let's see. What should I do? Uh, I'm going to have you execute that. There we go. There we are. That was worth it. Okay. Because I remembered la what happened last time that I did that. So that's the reason why I did that. You know, I hardly rarely use her for here. But it's worth it. It really is. Anyway, so, you know, it's just like not a whole lot going on stuff to talk about uh, otherwise I would talk about it I don't talk about shows and stuff very often but you know I'm gonna get back into this other show that I was watching I forget what it's called I mean at least it's I think somewhat fully complete unlike the two series I watched they were great and fantastic till I had to stop because you know there was a stopping point I hate stopping points in shows where it's like there's more but you know you just can't do it. it's like I also hate when they like make endings where there's like more and they never ever bother to continue it I don't care about what other people say whatever else you know there's still some lots of fans who liked it but it didn't really matter it really because if it did they would have considered that in consideration instead of going oh well you know I mean I could have come up with a better name than demo play but I just it doesn't really matter not gonna change anything. And again, it's not a cheat code, so if you're thinking that if you put it in there, all you're doing is just putting in a name, that's it. They wouldn't let you go that far with it. It's because you saw the name. <laughs> Kinda silly, ain't it? But that's just the way the game rolls, I guess. But yeah. So, I mean, because, I mean, literally, when a show ends and there's more to it, there should be more to it. You know, the, you know, and, you know, like, um, causing stigma, or no stigma, of the wind, should have at least finished off, if nothing else, at season two, uh, to wrap it up once and for all, because literally, um, even though the, the guy that was behind the, what was making it happen, passed away still he left some notes there and what to put in and they promised and then they said no I mean first it was actually no and then they and they promised and then they said no so basically it's a great show until they start you know forgetting that it means something to absolutely continue on a project even if that person has passed away it's like you know the shield the rising of the shield hero the um, it wasn't rushed as much when they first as much when they first brought it out for season two but then when they put it all together when you can watch it again it wasn't as rushed so that is a thing just so you know um, and the devil is a part-timer has so much more unanswered questions too even though they just got through doing season two they promised that this year and I mean this year would be the year for that to continue as well as I believe it's just Shrizing of the Shield Hero. And maybe I'll refer it to... And then next year we have... Um, what is it called? Um, the next chapter, which is I believe going to be Season 3 of uh, That Time I Got Reincarnated of the Slime. That's actually the title of it. Not me, I didn't get reincarnated. And I would love to see Skeleton Knight continue on, but that's not going to happen. So, I know that, it, you know, it's like so many reincarnations, and it would be nice if they actually did continue on. Otherwise, it just, it seems like a complete waste of a good potential to a game that, or, or show. I mean, 
They didn't even bother to wrap it up. They just said, eh, we'll just stop here. Or if they could have just included more, uh, more episodes. I don't give a hoot and nanny. Just do something instead of, well, I don't know, not doing anything. Roni Kenshin actually kind of didn't wrap up too well either. No, they actually screwed it up too when they did a stupid movie about where, ah, here we are, finally at 28 seats. We made our Mark Elder. You know, but anyway, where Roni Kenshin had failed was because they made this dumb movie where as soon as uh, him and her actually got together in the movie and this is in the movie of all things not in the show because yeah they got the move together in the show um they had a disease because they slept together it doesn't make any sense and supposedly he died from it that's kind of stupid that really ruined the series and not the way it was meant to be intended for like you know so what if him and her got together it's not the biggest deal in the world it's like why did they have to end it where they had a virus it's kind of stupid really you know really it is if you really think about it so we're actually going to stop here I guess will you stop and let me get out of here and so I can stop this video. We're going to go ahead and go heal up before we tackle on Wintry Cave. And we're going to go ahead and stop at Wintry Cave. Depending on where we're at. Yeah, we're, we're okay. Never mind. I thought it was on more than that. But no, we're good. We're going to keep going. And, uh... uh yeah, when uh, Falls Basin is like a short window open to opportunity so I don't need to like split it or whatever I can make it to a pretty long decent video not too long but long enough because we still have to do what's in the town and everything else blah 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 then we have to go over there and go to the the, the um to, to, you know get the crystal whatever so that's about how it goes about that way I'm not in one to spoil a game until, unless it's already been done, so. That is something that I thought I would point out. And yeah, so we're actually going to stop right here. And I'll see you. And. Oh, let's talk for a few seconds. Then I'll take a Wintry Cave here. Good. Yeah, alright, let's get in there. Yeah, because Wintry Cave is. Actually, you know what? I'll just do it in the next episode. Until then. Let